Hi, I'm Simon from Snowby, and we've come here today to the beautiful Chalkstream Valley of the River Avon. I'm actually stood in the middle of the river myself now at the moment. It's beautiful, the water's really clear. It's not as high as it might be, but it's still beautifully clear. There's, there's fish around us. I've actually seen some fish rising down here already, which is quite encouraging. And for many people, chalk stream fishing is the ultimate fishing experience for the fly fisher. And today we're going to experience all of that and some more, I hope, too. Ultimately, our quarry here today is the brown trout. And on a dry fly, that's what we're really looking to do. See a trout rise, put a fly to it and catch it. That's, that, for me, is everything on, on trout fishing. However, there are other fish here too. There's plenty of grayling in the river, I understand. There may be the odd uh, rainbow trout, possibly, and there may be even the odd coarse fish as well, which would be quite nice if we see them too. My choice of fishing today for a river like this, I brought with me two three-weight rods today. I brought a nine and a half foot prestige, which is my favorite rod for brown trout, nymphing, or whatever it might be, dry fly, everything. And I've also brought a 10 foot three-weight with me too. That's also the prestige. Uh, and I tend to use that for, for grayling, nymphing, and that sort of thing. And uh, if we find some grayling later on and they're not taking a dry, we'll perhaps just put that one into to some good use. I've teamed up my nine and a half foot three weight prestige with the brand new thistle down line from Snow, which I'm really looking forward to today. The conditions are great. It's not windy, which is really nice. It's warm, it's sultry. I've even seen a few flies coming off. And I think I'm going to start fishing down here. There's a bit of shade offered by the trees and so on. I even saw a fish rise just now. So I can't wait to get started. that tree behind. Put those scissors away. That's nice. I'm using the, um, the nine and a half foot prestige rod here which is my favourite. Um, I'm just keeping down under the bank here to reduce the profile against the sky although there are some trees on the far side of the field behind me which protects my silhouette a little bit. Nice little flick up there. Fish just had a look at it. This is magic. Trout fishing at its very, very best. Chalk stream fishing, you can see absolutely everything. Here's a fish looking at it right now. He's right underneath it and he's just turned away. He's still there, still there. Oh, it gets your heart going, it really does. Let's try again. Oh, just touch the tree then. Put it back, this little roll up flick. See if we can have him this time. Little stone fly just coming off there. No, he's not looking this time. I'm gonna pop it on the water this time and just give that fly a little flick to drop it off this, drop the leader off the top, that's better. And he's looking, he's coming back. Nope. Shorten that lead up a bit. That's better. Nope. Right, that sun's just coming out, but uh, I've just seen a fish rise up here under this tree. There's not a lot of fly life. I know we're quite late in the season. Obviously the ultimate time of the year to fish uh, these chalk streams and uh, everything is in the in May when the mayfly are up and everything. There's a fish looking at that fly right now. Let's try again. I think that's probably the one I saw. Chalk stream fishing, that's what it's about. You learn so much and so quickly because you can see everything that's going on. It gives you confidence. You can experiment and see things that work and don't work straight away. underneath that tree there. I'm just going to point the rod at the tree here. Sometimes you can, there's a fish, you can just pull it gently like that, it'll pull free. Like that. Nine times out of ten you'll get it back. A lot of people will grab at it but there's no need to. And we've got him. There we are, that was the one. Oh, that's fantastic. Lovely brownie. Sipped it off the top, that's exactly where I saw him rise just now.
gorgeous little fish. Take the fly out quickly and pop him straight back. I've got to be a bit careful here because of that tree over there keeping him out of the rubbish. He's come away now. Lovely fish, lovely brownie, beautifully thin, and uh, very typical of this part of the, of the River Raven and Wiltshire area today. Just slide it back in.
that sun's just about to come out, but I've just noticed over there, I heard there's some other fish in here. It looks like there's three or four chub right on the far bank, just underneath those trees. So I'm, that was a trout. Um, I'm gonna sneak in here and see if we can get one of those, which would be a real bonus. Here comes that sun. That's got him. Well, there's a little bonus to the day. A nice little chub from the river, the river raven here. I'll take it out gently. There you are. It's about a pound and a half, two pounds, and uh, came up and took the dry beautifully. I spotted them as we were walking up through fishing for the trout here, and it just goes to show that whilst there's plenty of trout in the river and plenty of grading as well, there are some bonus fish. And while we go trout fishing with a fly, it's really nice sometimes to catch something a little bit different, and that certainly is. Fought really well, and uh, came up for the just the, the dry straight off the top, and uh, yeah, real bonus to the day. What I've done is I've just put a small nymph on, and they're not actually feeding on dries, but they're grading well a bit deeper in the water. I'm hoping they'll come to the nymph. I did have a brown have a look just before. Let's get out of the way of them. Yeah, they're Well, they are, that's lovely um, Avon grayling. They're famous for the grayling on this river, it's beautiful. Um, it's a good winter species. A lot of fly fishermen today will target the grayling through the winter time. And um, this was feeding hard on, or not feeding hard, but sat hard on the bottom. There she is. Well, there we are, what a fantastic day we've had today. Chalk stream fishing at its very best. We've had some fantastic trout, really good quality. The river, for all the weather we've had this year, is absolutely superb. I've been using the prestige rod today, which is my favourite, and with this new thistle down fly line, I love it, it's really nice, and it's made the fishing today really pleasurable. We've had some brilliant brown trout fishing today, we've had some grayling, and we haven't had that lovely chub as well earlier on, and uh, it's been absolutely perfect. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope if you haven't had the chance that you get onto a chalk stream somewhere soon, and uh, thank you for watching.